Unbelievable. What a jerk. Tough day? Uh, yeah, try rough year. Hey, this is John. Yeah, I, I can't do that today. We did talk about it, and I told you that I can't do it. Look, that's ridiculous. If you would just take the time, you know you have the time. You're just being lazy. Which, hello? Things Great. not going too well? Yeah, you say that again. You leaving work early? Yeah, uh, place is out of control and people were driving me nuts. Yeah, Bob was out of line back there. Yeah, you know, can you believe that guy? Like, I, I wanted to kill him. He's such a liar. You know, Bob's going through a rough time now as well. You know Bob? Yeah known him for a long time. He's a good guy. <laughs> if you say so, buddy. You know, John, you didn't react in the best way possible either. How do you know? I, I'm sorry, do we know each other? It's been a long time. Uh, no offense, but I have no clue who you are. None taken. I know you've been busy with the Sterling Project, and your kids are out of control, and you and your well, wife. Yeah, cut, cut it out. I, I don't know who you are or what you're trying to pull here. I'm just trying to help. Oh, you want to help? You want to help me? Oh, okay, you know what? Why don't you start by trying to get my wife to talk to me? That'd be a great help. Or you know what? Maybe you can help me close this Sterling project so I can keep my job. That'd be a great help. Oh, wait, wait, I got a better one. Why don't you just throw a ton of money in my bank account? That would be great. If you can't do any of those things, just butt out. I'm sorry, you were just uh, freaking me out with the whole uh, Sterling Project thing, and I, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm tired and I'm stressed, and I'm working my tail off for all these things that are getting me nowhere. Sounds like you need a change in your life, John. How do you know my name? Oh, your dad wanted to name you Robert, but your mom wanted to name you Jonathan after her favorite uncle. <laughs> and we both know who won those arguments, don't we? <laughs> How do you uh, know so much about me? Oh, I know everything about you. <laughs> everything? <laughs> yes. Every tiny detail. Try me. <laughs> Every little detail, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll play along, wise guy. Um, in seventh grade, I had a crush on a girl named Sherry Rice. <laughs> and I wrote her a love note. It had three boxes. Mm -hmm. Yes, no, or maybe she had to check one, and I put it in her locker. Mm -hmm. What did I write that note on? On an apple hostess fruit pie wrapper. Wrong. I wrote on the back of an air supply tape that I gave her for Valentine's Day. So there. John, that was your second draft. The first draft you wrote the day before on the school bus on the way home on an apple hostess fruit pie wrapper. Yeah. You were sitting in the back on the left and you were wearing your favorite green members only jacket. <laughs> you should have stuck with that draft, John. You would have got better results. Um, I remember when she gave it back to you, when she had checked the no box. Boy, were you really hurt. And oh boy, were you mad at me. Oh my gosh, the names you called me. <laughs> yes. Oh. <sighs> are you who I think you are? Oh God, I mean, oh you. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh no, am I dead? Oh, no, John, you're, oh. you're not dead. Well, in that case, listen, the things I said to my wife last night, okay, I, I didn't mean those it's things. Okay. And, and the incident at the restaurant last week, that no, was not my fine. fault. It's fine. And the box of office supplies John. in my trunk, I was going to return John, those. it's Every okay. Single one of them. It's okay. We can deal with those things later. Sit down. John. Oh, I, I knew that. Here, you want one? Oh, no, those things will kill you. I know. They're positively sinful. <laughs> That's all right. I'll do a few extra miracles later on. <laughs> You'd be surprised how many calories those burn. I'm just joking, John. Don't take me serious, okay? <laughs> Actually, I do Pilates. John, help a God out here. I'm giving you the A material. Sorry, I, I guess I just don't feel like laughing. Yeah, a lot of people say that. Let me ask you something. What do you think you need to do to change your life? Oh, I don't, I don't know. Um, um, move.
went to Africa and become a missionary? No, John, that is not for you. How about um, letting go of some of these things? Think that would help? Well, with the way your things are working out. Yeah, good point. <laughs> Why don't we start with your money? Okay. What, what's in your wallet? All right. Um, $20. <laughs> yes. John. I did not know that was in there. <laughs> honest. John, you're doing great. Oh, by the way, happy birthday. I saw you bought yourself a little early birthday gift. Yeah, it's a, it's a 1983 Chevy Camaro IROC Z. It's got a, a CD player, a customized, customized stereo, stereo surround, surround sound. sound. Yeah, all the latest upgrades. can't believe I'm doing this. You're doing great, John. Uh, what's in your briefcase? Oh, uh, that Braun ET66 calculator, TP reports, quarterly reports, ID badge. Give me your job, John. You can have it. <laughs> no, I'm serious. Let me have it. Just let go. I, I mean, you're messing with my livelihood here. I, I mean, I don't make a lot of money, but I, how am I going to support my family? I, I, I've got bills to pay. I have insurance and a, a mortgage. Yes, you do have a nice home, especially with all the work you've done on it. Personally, I would have gone with Cranberry for the den, but that's your choice. You want my home, don't you? Wow, that's a, that's a lot to ask. Well, nobody's twisting your arm. <laughs> I mean, my... My money, my car, my job, my home. What's next? My family. <laughs> oh, you have a wonderful family. Oh, John. I do, I do, don't I? Uh, look, we uh, we just got this picture taken last week. Oh, yes, I remember that. My family. Seems like a lot to ask. Oh, it? you think? My wife, the kids. Okay, um, fine, fine, here, just take the photo. Uh, you know what, here, just take the whole wallet. In fact, there, you got everything now. That's all I got, that's everything I own. No, there's one more thing, John. No, there's not, I just gave it all to you, there's nothing left. Yes, there's one more. All that's left is me, right here, this is it. That'll do, John. You want me? Yes. What could you possibly do with me? You'll be amazed. Okay, you can uh, you can have me too. <sighs> Feels a lot better, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> actually, it, it, it kind of does. <laughs> um, so so now what? Now we begin. Okay. Here, John. Ah! Ah! Here. What? I don't. I don't know what to say. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs> Just remember that all these things are are mine. But in giving them to you as a gift, use them wisely. Um, you still have my life. Can I have that back? Do you really want it back, John? Uh, no, I, I guess I don't. Hey, what do I do with all these things now? Check in with, with me from time to time, and I'll let you know. Thanks. You're welcome. And John, just know I love you. 